Hello again. I dare say that viewers have now had a chance to look at the first data released from the 2021 census and I'm about to say that the figures are not as bad as some of us expected them to be. The population of England and Wales has increased by 3.5 million over the last 10 years and it now stands at 59.5 million which is the highest it's ever been. Roughly 1.5 million of this increase is by the natural number of births over deaths, meaning that in total some 2 million more people have come to live in the country since 2011. This works out at about 200,000 a year, which is a lot, but it's not as bad as many of us thought it would be. Between 2001 and 2011, the population of England and Wales increased by 7.8%. That is to say there were 4 million more people recorded between those two year, uh, 10 years. But the latest increase is 6.6%, which looks as though it is possible that immigration is slowing down a little. In the description to this video, I give a link to the data from the Office for National Statistics. Of course, many more babies are born to immigrant families than to white British ones in England and Wales, so the natural increase of the population, that is to say births over deaths, will include an awful lot of babies whose parents were not born in this country. Nevertheless, it might be that the population increase is now slowing down and perhaps might halt. It's interesting to look at the bar chart in the link I give and reflect that the population of this country actually fell slightly between 1971 and 1981. I doubt we shall see that happening again in a hurry, but who knows? Of course, the figures for ethnicity will not be published until 2023, and I am sure that we shall all be keen to see them. I rather suspect that the government are not at all... Uh, enthusiastic about those figures being known and they hope to leave their publication until the last possible moment.